you a little bit about what I'm doing laid up with my hurt knee. Um, here's my mom's place in a Tascadero. There's my blown out knee. This is my uh, little DAC factory workstation that I'm using to develop the um, backpack dyno. Here we have a, a function generator that's putting out a square wave DC output just like a Hall effect sensor would do, a Hall effect crankshaft sensor. I have the frequency range set to uh, mimic the frequency range um, you would be using to measure RPM from about 2,000 to 12,000 RPMs. So I could sweep the frequency here, and this device mimics the output of the crankshaft sensor. I have it running into the uh, LabJack U6 Pro data acquisition model module, and I'm monitoring the data with DAC factory software here. Here's a, a screenshot you could see of the a virtual tachometer I built based on the square wave output. So I could sweep the frequency and you could see it rev. Vroom, vroom, <laughs> anyway, that's about 12,000 RPMs. The sensor has enough reliability and resolution to, you could count seven events on one rotation of the crankshaft up to about 15, 16,000 RPMs. So it has more than enough sensitivity and rev uh, resolution for uh, what I want to do. Um, and then there's been a lot of learning curve in this, but there you could see a lot of the code I've written to configure the frequency counting um, timers in the data acquisition module and uh, set this thing up to actually convert um, the square wave output to RPM. You can see this number here. That's actually the time in microseconds between uh, square wave pulses. So that would be counting the time in microseconds per crankshaft revolution if you're using a Hall effect sensor. And then I just use some math to convert that to RPMs and display on this gauge. Right now, this gauge has a refresh rate of 100 times a second, so it has pretty smooth uh, response. And I'm sampling the uh, frequency counter 100 times a second as well. You could, you could go faster, but you may not really need to. Um, anyway, just wanted to give you a quick rundown of uh, how this is going.